did you have for lunch today, Lou? Biscuits. They didn't really like them though. <laughs> Very hazy this morning, you probably won't see it. Oh, really? Um, so it's not that rocky out uh, directly in no. front of us there. Then step to Deal Island and then Flinders Island and then Tasmania. God, CK. Wow. Look at a few fish around. Yeah. Birds. Probably a seal or two in there somewhere. Lightning came through the wall, knocked the water out. Now, when was that? When was the strike? Uh, New Year's Day, as near as we can make out. Okay. Um, our electricity was on for about an hour. And it took out the inverter, didn't it? And the, uh, the inverter, the power, well, our inverter powers the weather station, so it yeah. took out um, our phones, the inverter, which knocked out the weather station, and it also took out the um, controllers on the solar panels down here for the actual light. That's incredible. <laughs> Terrifying <laughs> prospects. Imagine being up here. Yeah. Installation. So this was the building in here. Yeah. And it went up through the roof there. I'm okay. not exactly sure what roof or it probably probably the other way from the photo. I can see it's another clear, clear photo there. Oh there we go. Yeah that's it there. Yeah. But as I say that Sorry. That's all right. I was going to get the info on it too. Yeah, right. But the um, the gearbox and base plate there, that was all down the, as I say, down the side of the track there for quite a few years. Okay. But I'd say one of the historical societies has grabbed that to, to get it refurbished. Yeah. And that panel over there is, is from that, is it? Uh, in a way. It was actually up the side of the hill. Um, 
that was a junction with a walking track over to Waterloo and the one the lighthouse is. Right. That was, I think, an early sort of form of friend and foe. Okay. So a ship would have like a beacon on it uh -huh. and they'd be able to tell what ship it was from the signal. I see. So I this picture. I haven't really it. done any homework on that, so. Okay, that's fine. But, um, mm. but I had a so, bloke here quite a few years ago who was actually a, um, a radar technician on modern radar and um, he'd done a study on the, the radar when it first came out. Um, invented by the British during the Second World War, and he said to the very earliest of radars, um, it was amazingly accurate. Mm -hmm. He said, with a good operator, it, you wouldn't believe how accurate it was for the first model ever produced. Mm -hmm. So, um, yeah. Mm -hmm. It is beautiful. <laughs> we could add on an extra day and do Camp Odeborn Bay again. Yeah. Um, uh, um, Saturday. If we have the time, we could. I don't really want to do it. I want to get home and see Mummy. Mm hmm. Daddy, where's Hogan Island? Hogan Island's the one, it's the flat one. It's out here. Oh, I can see it. You see it, Hogan Island? So, uh, is that yeah. it over there? Yes, it is. Yeah, I don't know if it'll come out on the video. It's, it's, it's almost distinguishable. Just in the haze, quite flat. Is that canoe? Yeah. Is there a light or something? I think so. We just spotted a replica of um, a galleon. You see a person on it? Yeah. Can I have a look now? 